All right, sorry, before I was putting the wrong side, not this side. It's up this side because the wire is coming out from this side. See, there's no wire, so sorry about that. So no one can go in. All right, I think this should be good now. Okay, you just push it all the way because those light block, uh, silver tape is really thin. It's put it back and just push in. If you just break through, go through. All right, this side do the same thing too. You see? Okay, looks like it pretty smooth. Okay, now next thing. You gotta put it back a uh, the diffusion. I mean, uh, liquid gas. Just wire like this. Just wire like this. Just put it back. I'm not sure you can see or not. And then set it on the bottom. Put back uh, four screws that I uh, took it out. You know, the smaller one that holding the plastics it's right here. One. That's right. So now, this is free over. Let me, let me get the liquid glass, and we go from here. Okay, here's my liquid glass. I want to make sure it's clean. It's clean. So we're gonna put it back like this. All right. Just be careful. Really important. Make sure the the glass is sit inside of the plastic film. If if it's not all the way in, when you snap the metal cover back, it's gonna crack the screens. I I had cracked a couple of screens before, so it's really painful experience. So make sure again, sit inside the plastic film. Okay, all four corners. Yep. So you grab it, hold the liquid glass, flick over. And then we're gonna put it back here. Make sure the wire is. Okay. Okay. So we go. Go. Here, snap. Good. All right. Now, last step. Put it back. This one. Should be. Yep. All right. Where's my bigger screwdriver here? Too many stuff on this. Last one. If you want to, you can add pierce the tape, but it really doesn't matter. So now it's done. This is drivers. So you can connect to either end. Here. It also comes with color coded wire. So basically, um, wet is representing the input voltage, positive. Black is power ground. Y is dimming control. Usually there's no connections. Just leave it uh, no connection. Yellow is extremely important. We call enable. You have to apply three to five volts on this yellow Y in order to turn this drive on and off, which is you can find those voltage from your existing inverter wire harness. In case your inverter does not have enable voltage and um, there's a jumper, I mean a jump, jumper, I'm not sure you can see it, a really fine pin. It's called JP2. JP2 right here. 
you just add a piece of solder or wire, you short it out. Then all you need to do is just connect the positive and negative. It should work. Thank you for watching.